वन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट द चैप्टर ई गवर्नेंट इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर डेवलपमेंट एंड अंडर दिस द फर्स्ट टॉपिक इज नेटवर्क इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर नेटवर्क इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर ओके सो विल स्टार्ट विद द डेफिनेशन ऑफ नेटवर्क इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर अलॉन्ग विद द वेरियस कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ इट सो वॉट इज अ नेटवर्क इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर सो नेटवर्क इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर रिफर्स टू रिफर्स टू द फ्रेमवर्क फ्रेमवर्क ऑफ इंटरकनेक्टेड इंटरकनेक्टेड डिवाइसेस कम्युनिकेशन मीडियम कम्युनिकेशन मीडियम सॉफ्टवेयर्स सॉफ्टवेयर्स एंड प्रोटोकॉल्स दैट facilitate the exchange of data and information information within an organization within an organization or between various organization okay so what is this what is the definition so this is nothing network infrastructure it is nothing but all the components for example suppose if you are in an organization and if you want to share information share your data you'll need a router you'll need a uh, you'll need a system okay you'll need a switch you will need some firewall to protect the information you will need a server to store the data so these are nothing but the network infrastructure so network infrastructure they are the interconnected devices devices means routers switches servers communication medium it can be wire or wireless for example twisted pair if it is a wire wifi if it is a wireless various softwares it means the various programs for example os we can say and protocols protocols means the various rules okay so all these are interconnected together in order to facilitate the exchange of information which can be within a organization or within two organization so this is nothing but this is called the infrastructure network infrastructure we can say okay so uh, in uh, under this network infrastructure we have got various components okay so various components so first components are uh, we can say hardware component hardware components so we all know about these things okay so hardware components so hardware components first one is router okay so we, everyone we, everyone we know about what is router so a router is used to direct the traffic direct the data between network between network we also call it as routing next one is switches okay switches it is used to they are, they are the device they are used to connect devices within the same network and facilitate the communication and facilitate the communication okay next one is next device is third device is our firewall so firewall they are the security devices we can say they are the security devices devices that monitor and control the traffic control the traffic okay fourth one is our server okay so server they are very powerful devices okay and they provide the resources or they provide they provide resources or services to other computer known as the client okay computer they also called client okay so these are some of the uh, hardware components uh, we can say and next one is our uh, second one is cabling we can say yeah cabling or we can say the connecting devices or communication medium let us say yes communication medias this i am talking about the um, components okay communication medians so cabling we can have ethernet okay ethernet we can have copper cable this is nothing nothing but the ethernet and copper cabling they are same 
next one can be our fiber optics okay so i'm not going to talk in detail about this because i guess you know about this what is ethernet what is a copper cabling what is a twisted pair yes twisted pair next one is our wi-fi or the wireless connection okay next third component is our network protocol okay so we have learned about various protocols in network computer network so i hope you have studied computer network so here we have got a number of protocols such as tcp ip protocol you can write about this sctp protocol or sctps protocol dns protocol yes imap protocol okay so what is this what is what are this protocol tcp ip protocol so they are used for communication between two um uh, we can say two devices the rule that we follow which is known as tcp ip protocol sttps hypertext transfer protocol this is used for communication dns domain name system this is used for converting the ip address or the name into the ip address okay imap protocols it's imap okay imap protocol this is used for sending the mails okay so these are some of the protocols and talking about the various uh, next component which is our softwares okay so in softwares we can have various os operating system we can have our firewall firewall also the software we can have various network management software network management software okay so these are the software and uh, i think uh, these are the components or these are the network infrastructure that we are talking about so using all these components we are going to build a you know infrastructure network infrastructure for example if this is organization a and this is organization b so here we can have um, we can have components like systems we can have inside system we'll have some os okay and we can have server so these are used to communicate with the server we can have router they are going to route the information we are going to have switches we can have router here so they are going to route the information from this uh, network a network to sorry from a organization to b organization or network we can say inside this again we'll have systems in systems we are going to have os across this we are going to install a firewall so this is nothing but um, a network infrastructure that is used to communicate the data between two organization or within the organization okay so that's all about network infrastructure till then stay safe and thank you